Silence in the courtyard, silence in the streets. The biggest mouth in England is just about to speak. Oh yeah, I mean, I forgot it's Wednesday. Hot, Wednesday and then, then they're really fucking hot as well. Yeah. It was incredibly hot. I fucking love you. <sighs> and so pretty. And they love us all. So Tony Cruz came tonight and he plays for Madrid. And um, also the German national team. And he's won, just as a side to the story, he's won uh, three um, Champions League Cups, one World Cup, and like eight titles, like Bundesliga and the Spanish League. Anyway, I was going to tell him a story about the time I did the Bambi Awards in Germany, which are, you know, you receive a Bambi Award, it's a big um, honour to be bestowed on you, and I fortunately won two. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Joachim Lowe, the manager of Germany, was like, he'd gone viral because during a match he'd sort of scratched his bum, <laughs> then sniffed his finger, <laughs> then scratched his penis, and then sniffed his finger again. And it, was, it was all on camera, and it had like gone viral, gone viral around the world. So as I came on to perform my song, he was in the front row, and I, I stuck my hand down my trousers and then sniffed my <laughs> finger and then like looked at him and nodded and winked like I thought I was gonna get like hey banter back well there was just like stone dead the look could have killed me it was just like no we're not bantering about this and I now hate you can you remember I do remember and I remember his look yeah so Joachim Lowe I didn't mean <laughs> to embarrass you or to belittle you. I just thought we were doing a bit of banter and um, I'm sorry that it came across any other way. But then of course, like the English press picked it up. Do you remember, Michael? I do remember, yeah. Robbie Williams yeah. goes on the television and then sniffs his hand after he's stuck it down his pants <laughs> and he didn't like what he smelled. <laughs> so. Literal reporting. Yeah. Mm. So if anybody saw that, news piece and wondered what I was doing. It was that. Yet again, I apologise to Joachim Lowe. I admire you so much. I don't know where I'm sitting, mate. It's gone. Oh, don't take a phone in there. Why? It's got tired. <laughs> well, I am doing. Hi, guys. Vloggy Williams here. We're in Paris. It's a bit rainy. Taking Biz out for a walk. To the bottom of the Champs Elysees. Get some fresh air. We're at the bottom of the Champs Elysees. As you can imagine, it's quite touristy. We've got double espresso on. Um, I'm going to try and find a spot to do uh, a lip sync to something without drawing attention to the fact that Robbie Williams is doing a lip sync to something at the bottom of the Champs Elysees. Let's see what happens. Uh, the photographs of Mars put my footprints on the moon. I wanted the unions and loves, and then we hide it. Don't dare look inside it. We pour our hearts into a box, seal that trying to find out how much this is because I think Ivor would look absolutely amazing in it. But I guess I'm going to have one of those moments. What's your guess? Huh? What's your guess? You what? What's your guess? If you guess it right. What's your... Okay, yeah. alright. 6,000? Euro. Yeah, what do you guess? Four. Okay. How much did it end up being? So you thought it was four grand. Yeah. I thought it was six. It was 35,000 euros. 
35,000. Not 100. Not 3,500. Not 350. 35,000 pounds. Babe? Yeah, is everything okay? We just went out walking um, showbiz around Paris. Yeah. And then um, came back to the hotel and was passing Roberto Cavalli. And there was a, yeah. a beautiful dress in there. Like. Yeah. Like I'm gonna get I'm gonna yeah, like absolutely incredible. I was like I'm I'm gonna get that for Ida and uh, Yeah, no well listen <laughs> <laughs> listen though. Leo Yeah Leo was like uh, how much do you think it is? And I said I think it's six. I was probably willing to pay seven or eight and he thought it was four and it yeah. was 35,000 euros. Yeah. Oh, bless you. Yeah, oh, but. Babe, just the fact that you had that thought is so sweet. Yeah. You get me two of them. Yes, of course I did. We are in a lift in Paris <laughs> on the way to the gig. Um, Beers has had a very bad stomach, and uh, but now he's very, very happy by the looks of him. I think uh, whatever he had has now gone. And he's just back to being happy dog. <laughs> We're at the O2, it's a, an Adal concert, and we get into the lift, <laughs> and two policemen with a dog with a high vis jacket on get into the lift. And I said, Excuse me, gentlemen, just make sure of one thing is, is that dog a drug sniffer or a bomb sniffing deterrent dog? And they went bomb, so I went, Okay, cool. <laughs> Floor one, please. <laughs> well, thank fuck for that. <laughs> <laughs>